That's what I'm saying. It's not so obvious yet. It's, it's not obvious. So that's why. It's why the, the, the design. It's called self uh, I don't think it's a part of the plan. I think he just, he just, he just plays that much go. He's that good. So that's not a lot. It's like a nature tool. If you see any of his games, though, they're all crazy like this. Okay. But I mean, they don't run a ladder across the board, but there's just crap everywhere. You don't know what he's doing. Like this, this is like what he does. Just to capture these and take back all of these stones. Now, what does white have? What are white get out of this? So this group is captured by white. A lot of cutting points. Yeah, a lot of cutting points. White takes one immediately. And just like, hey, I want to eat some stuff. These are all just weaknesses, right? So black obliges us. I believe actually black plays in the fancy way. White can capture one stone, but black will capture back. At the same time, Atari that stone. And when white plays that, white plays this. Right now, white is thinking, okay, so black got all this. But white basically just got all of this. That's a pretty good exchange, right? I don't really want to go over it today because it's not as important. Um, I suggest you go back to that email and go through the end here. But in the end, White uh, Lee Sadol kills all of this. It all dies. Brands the only reason why it dies is because White is trying to kill anything that's black over here. But that's that's sort of the end of the story. So here, here's here's a couple points I want to make. Right? So Go is this really flexible thing, right? Like, you know, really surprising. You could say that Hong Jansik was tricked a little bit right, with this whole ladder thing, because Lee Sadol goaded him a few times, ran out this ladder a little bit, and then went down here and played this trick move, and was like, oh, now you got to pick. What do you want? And then proceeds to run out the rest of the way when, you know, uh, Hong Jansik seemed like he defended everything he needed to defend, just in order to get one more stone and take the corner back. I mean, that's... That's how quickly a go game can turn all around, right? What you think is yours in one moment, seven moves later, is completely opposite as your opponent's. And uh, in the end of this game, like I said, this all dies, all of this white dies. The ladder stays alive, honestly. The ladder lives. <laughs> and then white makes some sort of small, strong, semi strong, not even alive, but he resigns before he, he they play it out. Group over here. So white gets the corner, the ladder, and that's black on the board. Everything else is black. These are strong, I mean, they're both strong and go professionals. These are good players. Uh, you guys have any thoughts or questions? You don't have the rankings at the time? Uh, at least I don't think it was mine now. Sorry, that's mine. Um, on John's sake, I, I actually don't know. I suspect he's not too at that time. But I could be wrong. So I would never guess that behind him. Well, exactly. You can't look at this and go, what? Oh, do you guys just learn? Yeah, so it's, it's, well, it's like they don't understand ladders. Right? Someone, someone doesn't understand how a ladder works. But it's all part of, you say, it all plants. White didn't play an extra move at the bottom just to make sure it's dead. Yeah. In a professional game, every move counts. If White ever has to go back and play an extra move, okay. Black's going to get a free move somewhere else. That's too much. And yes, this is 16 points, but it's only 16 points. That's both a large and a small amount on the go board. There's a, there's a very famous Koseki that I like to play just against people who don't know it called the 18 and a half point trick Koseki. So now I'm Or you give up an entire corner, it's worth about 18 and a half points for just a solid wall. And the idea is that the wall is actually far superior to the 18 and a half points. So I know you want to play out, but should it happen? But a lot of can you sort of sketch? Yeah, we can go back and sort of. Uh, oh no, not, not the ladder. Oh, not the ladder? You're saying black ends up with all that territory on the lower left? And yeah. Oh, yeah, you, you want to see, you want to see that sequence? Well, I know you want to play a lot. I just, I don't really understand the basic idea that that white enclosure looks secure and all black has these horrible walls. Yeah, I don't have this part memorized. So do you mean black actually has 
actually kills that, or do you black kills everything? Right now, black is just trying to make sabaki. Black's trying to make shape. Just find some free moves so black can just live here, right? Because this wall is really strong. It's white wall. And, uh, black. So when black attacks here, white has to be cautious about this. So white comes down here and tries to uh, separate, right? This is now a strong group because this has been captured from these friends. Uh, but that lets this to be one. Basically, this turn is just a giant fight where something's going to die. Blacks is trying to make mischief and cut. Any, any cut, any, any attachment, Blacks is going to make it. And uh, in the end, just have enough moves. So that the whole thing just works. Somehow. Oops, that closed down. But anyway, it's. Well, something like email. Okay. All right. So that's Lee Sedol's ladder game. Pretty amazing. Two professionals actually run a ladder across the board just so one of them can get in one extra move. Capture, recapture that 55 corner. All right, you guys want to play some Go? Be inspired? Try to do something creative, crazy? You know, learn something? And then the is really I don't, you probably can't. Most of the time, you can't run your opponent's ladder all the way across the board and hope for it to work out for you. It's not a good plan. Here, but Nick said, but Nick said <laughs> it totally works. It is a little bit of a trick move, right? I mean, Han Jansik got tricked. Han Jansik John shouldn't run this out. Should just spend another move defending over here, cube up one stone, and just call it a day. Yeah, we can play. We can play too. Okay. All right, want to play a game? Thanks. You're not going to trick me? Oh, you, you girls trick me all, more often than you think, though. <laughs>